This is James with WSTrades.com. I want to bring you an update here, but before I get to this update, I want to say if you are looking for a trading account and you are new to the stock market, Moomoo does have a pretty good promotion going on right now. So if you go to the link in the comments and description section of this video, sign up for Moomoo and make a deposit. They do have this promotion going on where you can receive up to 15 free stocks plus one extra share of Tesla or Google. So if that's something that you're interested in, head to that link, check it out, head over to Moomoo and sign up and you know get some free stock. Hey everyone, this is James with WSTrades.com. I want to provide an update here on ticker BBBYQ or Bed Bath & Beyond. So I've got the 15 minute chart pulled up here in Thinkorswim and this is what we're seeing here, waiting for data, there is no data here on the chart because this ticker, this symbol, these shares are toast, they are done. So this little spinning bar here in Thinkorswim means you are screwed if you were still holding shares of BBBYQ um, before they canceled the shares and made them worthless. Um, so definitely red flag right here. If you go in and see this, uh, that means your investment is toast, you're done, you're not getting anything. Um, so I posted a video on Bed Bath & Beyond or BBBYQ yesterday and I got a lot of comments um, or I had a couple comments and ended up turning into a long conversation. So a lot of interest on my video yesterday and people are just claiming I'm wrong. I don't know what I'm talking about. There's going to be some type of reemergence and people are going to get their DK butterfly shares and blah, blah, blah. And I kind of made that video yesterday as a joke. I kind of put a joke thumbnail on there saying is DK Butterfly going to the moon because DK Butterfly is not a thing like that's not a company that's going to ever trade there's never going to be any shares of DK Butterfly but you know I have made other videos as well talking about different comments I've seen I made one video where I went on reddit and I saw people talking about a reverse merger with Lego so some people think this chapter 11 from Bed Bath & Beyond is going to be used to um do some type of a merger with another company and they're going to get shares of this you know combined company and blah 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 all this nonsense so i want to show you some bankruptcy court filings and show you why that is not going to happen it's not true these people that are saying it's going to happen are just in denial or they're delusional um you know there are going to be no dk butterfly shares issued and soon enough you're going to see in edgar where we see the sec filings you're going to see that symbol fall off of bbbyq um, you know, it has the company name, which is now DK Butterfly, blah, blah, blah. But you'll also see the symbol and where it's trading, whether it's OTC or whether it's NASDAQ. And soon you're going to see that fall off and you're going to be in the same exact situation as the AVCT shareholders. So let's come in here and take a look. So, um, you know, I think it was in 2013, um, American Airlines filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy, but they actually had a plan to continue operating. It was not like AVCT, it was not like BBBYQ, it was a totally different story. Um, and I just wanna show you the bankruptcy filing that kind of shows you what does it look like when a company continues to operate or has a plan to continue to operate and they're not going completely out of business and then what it looks like for BBBYQ, which is a totally different story. So here is uh, the 76 page uh, bankruptcy court filing here. It says Southern District of New York, United States Bankruptcy Corp. If you look through this document, you'll see references of this company continuing to operate. So right here, it says continued corporate existence. You will not find that in the court filing for BBBYQ. I'll show you that later, but if you look through that court filing, you're not gonna see anything that says the company is going to continue to operate. You're not gonna see anything that actually says the shareholders are gonna actually have some value for their shares. BBBYQ is a totally different story. So it says right here, for American Airlines, when they did chapter 11, pursuant to section 6.1 of the plan, subject to the merger and terms of the merger agreement, each debtor shall, as a reorganized debtor, continue to exist after the effective date as a separate corporate entity. That is key there. This is not happening with BBBYQ. There is no plan, there is no section of the plan that says they are gonna have continued corporate existence. So that is really key there. Um, if we come into BBBYQ here and their court filing, it's a totally different story. So this one is uh, United States Bankruptcy Court, District of New Jersey. Um, and if you scroll down in the document, you're gonna see it's a totally different story. There is no plan to continue. It says right here, interest in BBB or Bed Bath & Beyond. The treatment here, 
for those interests or those you know, shares of common stock. Each allowed interest in BBB shall be canceled, released, and extinguished, and will be of no further force or effect, and no holder of interest in BBB shall be entitled to any recovery. That is key there. You are not recovering anything. If you are a common shareholder, you are done. You are toast. I think I made a video on that before where they had like 40 million in assets and 1.5 billion in debt when they filed this bankruptcy. So you are not getting anything if you are a common stockholder. I mean, it says it right here, it is very clear, but people are just, they're high on hopium, they are not accepting this reality. This is a totally different story. And if you remember AVCT or American Virtual Cloud Technology, I wanted to bring this one up because this is key. If you go into Edgar and you look at uh, you know BBB, which is now DK Butterfly-1, you can see they actually list the symbol here, BBBYQ on the OTC. This is soon going to fall off. Soon you are going to look like this, where there's just a company name and there is no symbol because those shares have been extinguished and canceled. They are toast. So this is your future. BBBYQ, uh, people that were holding shares before this thing went completely under and they canceled the shares. Um, so just get ready for this because this is what Edgar is going to look like for you um, if you've got uh, shares of BBBYQ still showing in your brokerage account. But let's come into ABCT and kind of show you exactly why this is the same situation for you. Uh, your shares canceled, worthless, just like ABCT. If you come into the ABCT SEC filings regarding their Chapter 11 filing, it says right here, cautionary information regarding trading in the company's securities. Under the plan of liquidation confirmed by the court, the holders of the company's common stock and warrants will not receive a distribution. You're not getting anything. You are done. This is the same story as BBBYQ. It says on account of their equity interest and the company's common stock and warrants were canceled. So that means they are worthless. They have been canceled. Even though the company's common stock and or warrants may continue to be quoted on the OTC pink market, which they're not anymore. At one time they were, but I just showed you, right? Even in Edgar, you no longer see a symbol there. You cannot trade these anymore. Under the plan of liquidation, such securities have no underlying value. That means they are worthless. So don't listen to these people you see in the comments of my videos that are claiming that BBBYQ is not dead. This is just like AVCT. It is dead. The shares are worthless. You're not recovering anything. You are done. And people keep saying, I see, just saw a comment this morning, like, oh, well, I guess we'll see. Time will tell. It might take a while, to be honest, uh, for you to see that fall off, um, where that symbol is no longer there in Edgar. You'll start to see those um, SEC filings, or they'll update Edgar, and you'll see that there is no longer a symbol. So it may not happen very quickly, but this is your future. This is the exact same setup that we saw with ABCT or American Virtual Cloud Technologies. They're filing Chapter 11 to liquidate everything. Unlike American Airlines, they are not filing Chapter 11 to restructure and continue operations. American Airlines continued to fly people in planes. BBBYQ shut down every single store that they have. They sold their name and public IP address to Overstock. Totally different story. So again, I know there's going to be people commenting on this video today. Delusional, in denial, super high on hopium. But these are the facts. These are the SEC filings. These are the bankruptcy court filings. So if you want to refute what's going on in the SEC filings and you want to refute what's going on in the bankruptcy court, you're just in denial. Um, and, you know, make better decisions next time rather than sit out here and make these stupid comments on YouTube and Reddit and trying to give people false hope. Make a better decision next time. Stop trying to get greedy and become a millionaire overnight getting in on some short squeeze of some crappy company that went bankrupt and you're just, that's what you're praying for. That's what you're hoping for, right? You get in on this shares dirt cheap because rightfully so the shares are dirt cheap because the company went bankrupt. They're liquidating everything and the shares are soon gonna be worthless. You know, don't be a little piggy that gets slaughtered because that's exactly what happened here. People wanted to get in, buy 100,000 shares, buy a million shares of some crap company and then they were expecting some massive return on their investment and just like ABCT you are not getting that so make better decisions next time stop investing in companies like BBBYQ that are on the verge of bankruptcy or have already failed unless you like losing your entire investment 
There are better investments out there. There are better things to trade out there. Even if you're not a long-term investor, you want to swing trade or day trade or something like that, there are better things to put your money in where you won't get completely wiped out like AVCT and BBBYQ. So I just want to make an update here and if I continue to see this thing trend um, in YouTube searches, I might continue to cover it. Um, I guess it also depends on you know when these delusional people stop commenting on my videos that are in denial, but I'll continue to keep you updated here on BBBYQ or what was BBBYQ. Shares have been canceled, they're worthless now. Please like this video. Please also subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed. Hit that notification bell. Appreciate you for taking the time to watch this. Talk to you soon.